All right. Ba -da -da -ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba -ba -da. MC's previous favorite Zelda game. Yeah, I, 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 <laughs> previous Zelda game. <laughs> Previously yeah. on ZZZ. That's we've been talking about a lot of good games, but we're we're down to our final two. The Zinzaker. The Zinzaker. That's me. Can't be. I'm MC. And we're talking about Wind Waker HD, brand new, never before played. I know. I'm self and wrap, <laughs> ready to go. I know. Boy, there's a lot going on on this cover, and I appreciate the HD cover so much better than the SD cover. Yes. There. I Ganon just makes this so much better. It's true. He's so good. Link, he's kind of a clown, but look clown. at everyone else. You got all the good boys and girls. Like, why is the king so small? He's so small. <laughs> like, Harold's huge. <laughs> it, it just has, it hits everyone. Holographic. Uh, one thing I really like is how everyone's gold, but him. Yes. He's green. He's green. He's so cool. So, so when it comes to, like, the, the gold covers, this is a really good gold cover. Yeah, no, they did a really good job. Uh, they kept the King of the Red Lions uh, part of the logo with everything, which was really cool, mm -hmm. which was a part of the original cover. Um... And, and, not, and funny enough, the actual Wind Waker is not seen inside the cover, which you, you think it would be, right? On the cover or there? Uh, I, 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 meant, I meant the logo. I'm oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Or King of Red Lines is more known. Yeah. Um, side's cool. It's fine. You got King of the Red Lines right there. There is a lot of pictures going on. Whoa, there's, there is so much going on. There's this ten, 10 screenshots here, 11. Wow. Yeah. This might be a new record for screenshots. This is so the Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker is reborn in HD on the Wii U. Use The Wind Waker to command the winds as you explore the great sea in pursuit of a timeless evil. Who's that timeless evil? Improved controls with the Wii U gamepad. It, it was. I, I yeah. agree. Yeah. I agree. Connected through Deadverse. Yeah, it, me it, it mentions Meverse, and that's a, a, one of those moments where you're like... <sighs> Rest in peace. Rest in peace, Meverse. That was very good. Rest um, in peeverse. <laughs> It it, it 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 hits on a lot of the like the big things. Um, it's a very good cover. The back's okay. The back's, a, back's got a lot of stuff. A lot on. of stuff going on with it. Um, and, and two of these big blocks, they they, they look for like like instruction manual bits, honestly. Yeah. And not like good at like unlike the 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 Breath of the Wild one. It, it mentions the gyroscope, which is very important to this the game. The gyroscope is very important. It makes this it makes this game very important. Wind Waker HD box art. Ten. Ten? Ten. Ganon really makes it. Ganondorf. I, I, I was thinking an eight. I'm, keep, I'm keeping it an eight. I like this a lot. Be, be because of the... Uh, I don't like the back. I feel like the back Oh, uh, the back sucks. But like when I'm looking at this... Like, sitting at GameStop, my whole oh, crap it looks amazing. It does. It really it does. It's so good. Very good. I'm very happy with it. Now the story is, honestly, I I did not give Breath of the Wild a ten out of ten score. I recognize the faults there. Yeah. This one I'm gonna put down my ten early. Yeah. No, I get that. Because, it 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 starts out with telling you about Ocarina of Time, and then it's just like, but forget that. This is just a kid, and it's his birthday. Happy birthday. Wait, my sister's kidnapped, and then it leads into you need to rescue her. Then you, then you meet this pirate girl, and you're yeah. like, who the heck are you? It goes from pirates to, like, well, if you want to rescue your sister, you're going to need more than just busting in there with a cheap little sword. You're going to need the big boy sword. And so you get the big boy sword, and, and you meet Ganondorf, and he's like, well, I, I, I escaped the hero of time, and that mass sword... is not strong at all. And so no power. And so, like, Link has to come back again, but this time we go, we go right to, to his underground... To his yeah. underground lair. Lair. And... The real story that I want to touch on before we get into everything character-wise is, and why this is a 10 for me, is the extremely good storytelling of the contrast between the king and Ganondorf. Mm -hmm. The king is wants to you to rescue Hyrule so he can be be the ruler again, how unflood his world and like and like and, and be happy. And Ganondorf wants to, to, to rule Hyrule so he can unflood Hyrule and, and he can rule over it with evil. And the king is the one who realizes that the only way for the world to thrive again and people to be happy it's just in his Hyrule. World is destroyed. It's like you've lost. Yeah. Hyrule has been lost, and, and he is the one who, who puts the final nail on the coffin, and he says, you know, 
it, 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 this was my, my duty to, to, to let it go. Yeah. Captain goes down with the ship. It's very poetic, and it's a 10 out of 10. And you get thrown in characters like Medley Macker and, and your sister, Errol, the pirates, everybody on Windfall. The supporting cast just fills out an already amazing story. Yeah, um, I think like there's, there's a couple parts that are really just kind of like, uh, to me, but like the biggest thing that sticks out is just the final uh, confrontation with Ganondorf. Just like, when, like once you're about to fight him, which is just amazing because his monologue right there is just insane. It's I think it's some of the best writing in yeah. Zelda. Yeah, no, like, like it and Twilight Princess matched. Yeah. And the only thing that just like there's just some little things that just bother me about it. I want to talk one about one thing, but you got um, boy, Triforce Quest sucks. But is that is that story? Because I mean, this, the, but, you're, but the story is you have to go collect all of this. I mean, the story. I, I think the story bit of that is really good. Where it's like, like, you, you know, you you may have fully powered the master, but you are not ready yet to return to Hyrule because only the hero can return to Hyrule. You need the Triforce. Find it. I, I think that's a very good story bit. Eight. Okay. Can I mention my negative? Sure. Zelda kind of sucks. Yeah, no, <laughs> like, like I did. They took Tetra, and she was dang. She was so cool, and then they made her so useless. The second they put her in a dress, they literally troped it out of their mind, and she just became useless. Yeah. <sighs> I mean, I mean, she does help you deliver the final blow. Like that, that's. But cool. she was so cool. That's cool. So funny. So witty. And then she just sucked, and then she got emotions. And then she was like, oh. I mean, it's not like, like so could yeah. have, uh, she Tetra could have had those emotions while re retaining her style. Like, like she could have been like, "I'm the princess." I don't think you got the right yeah, girl. Yeah, like, and, like, and, 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 like, like she could have said that, and, and yeah. that would have. Seen and, like if they moved, if they moved, spirit tracks over, like to swap those two Zeldas. Oh my! Yeah, God. wow! I never realized how much spirit tracks Zelda feels like. What she's supposed to feel like? Actually, no, I I take that back because she she feels very much like I'm the princess. I I shouldn't have to do all this. Yeah, thing. I just and think, I, like I, I, I think she's just funny. Yeah, she's good. But um, you know, I'm a six eight. Like okay. it's very good storytelling. It's some of the best story writing. There's a little couple of nuances I have a, a world. Are, are we gonna have a, a fight about the world? A fight about the world. Should I offer up my heart piece now or later? <laughs> I so first time playing it. It was very, it's it's very big. It's very cool. I like like the Horizon thing, discovering new things. It, it it's, it's too open. It's way too open with a bunch of nothing. And you don't necessarily always get the Swiss sale. No, it, especially if we're, if we're going to first time playthrough, the Swiss sale is yeah, not gone. Yeah. But but I mean, without the Swiss sale, it can be a drag. It can oh, be. Uh, yeah, like, and it's until you can start instantly teleporting. Like, does it make it, like... Which you don't get until at least after uh, two dungeons. Yeah, it, it's just... It's so cool. Like, the stuff that makes it good with it is, like, the music and going out, and it, it's very neat, but, boy, is it a bunch of nothing. And I didn't like Wind Waker at first until I played HD, and I was like, wow, this is a very gorgeous game, but good graphics can only get you so far on a very, very empty world. Like... There's no hub. The ocean's the hub. Yeah. And it's just, like, not good hub. So I can feel that and respect that, because when I think about, like, the most plain Jane Wind Waker experience, it, it's pretty empty. Like, it, it, if, you, it, if you're just going exactly plot point to plot point, um, and I feel this gets really much into why I like Breath of the Wild and why why I think Breath of the Wild became my favorite Zelda game is because I felt like it, it took the Wind Waker exploration method of, like, what's that on the horizon and just... Brought it in a lot better with like without C, and instead you have you know different terrain that you have to like the the, the, the up down is what what made the world better. Yeah. Um, I think the Wind Waker world is good. I feel like the islands are, are fun to, 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 to find and, and like you know there's there's so many different you know unique little areas like there's the little unique islands but there's no big unique islands. No, no. And that's because like, they're all dungeons, and you notice that once you get there, you're like, oh, this is a dungeon. This yeah. is going to be a dungeon. There's not like there's not really anything like. Like, like I just wish there was a good hub space. Like, just anywhere, just a nice large island, stuff like that. Like, just like even Windfall and Outside are not huge. No, by, it's, by they're so small. And like, you, you, you run out of things to do, like, messing around with the pigs for, like, five minutes, and that's it. Like, you're like, oh, well, that's boring now. Like, it, it's just, it's so large. And even, like, 
it's so large and it's full of nothing that, like, even with the speeder, and they're just like, there's a, a way of traveling that eliminates you just looking at the sea. You just whoosh, boomerang, or like just zoosh across. Like, because yeah. it's that open, there's nothing in your path a lot of the time. It, 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 I see that it is very magical for the first time, but it is. It's infinitely worse than Breath of the Wild, in my opinion. The, despite, I, I think the, I don't think it's completely empty because there there are little encounters. There's the octos, there there are the, the platforms, and all those do offer good rewards. They're especially useful in in Triforce Quest stuff. But four, okay. I'm not I, I'm not gonna lie to you and say that it's like a ten out of ten world like Breath of the Wild. Yeah. Um. I I, I think it's good. I think it's good. I, I think it was a. I think all the islands, I don't know, I hold a special connection to the islands, even though they aren't extremely varied. Four. Okay, he's using a hard <laughs> piece on me to make it a four, and I will accept, I will accept and be disappointed. <laughs> And, uh, I, I agree with Bobby Scar Newman on this. It's just very empty and just not good. Let's talk about first play because this is very good. This game's sick. Yes. Wind Waker HD is sick on your first time playthrough. And barring the Triforce Quest, which it, the only thing that kind of sucks is if you don't pick up the incredible chart from your mailbox, yeah. which, which shows you where all the Triforce pieces yeah. are. If you don't pick that up, you're going to be a sad boy. Yeah. But like, it, it does a very good job of shaking. Yeah. Um, controls were so spot on with the HD version. Like, yeah, no, it, the it feels so good. So good. It looks so good. Yeah, like, and people are like, why, is you, why are you using gyroscope? I'm like, because it feels so good. P puzzles are clear. Enemy encounters are clear. And, li and like, and like it, it, everything just feels... Menuing on the second screen so good. Like, you know what's going on on your screen it, all the time. It, it's, it's not... It, it's close to, if not, the most polished Zelda game, in my opinion. Yeah. Like, I feel it like... It feels so good. Yeah. Like, like it, it took the Ocarina of Time standard of, 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 expo of, like, of, like, dungeoning and... Just like smoothed out the edges, like both both visually and like like technically. Yeah. Um, story is great. We were mentioning that the, you know the music uh, that that first time played through is is with you. Triforce Quest. Oh, 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 my, my only little dip. Tower of the Goddesses. Tower of the Gods. I like Tower of the Gods. It, it gets obnoxious. But I like it, Tower of the Gods. Uh, it, it's 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 a it's a linear dungeon. Yeah. It's very linear. I mean, um, I'm not kind of going to lie. All the boss fights are fun. I I didn't really mind. I think like. Uh, Puppet Ganon sucked the most. And Pu Puppet Ganon was hard. Puppet Ganon was a good hard yeah. um, I, as a kid. Um, Spire. <laughs> none of the bosses were hard. C Kali Deimos didn't give me trouble. Uh, just hanging on Valu's butt was sick. Yeah, go, go, that was Goma. cool. I've I, I, I died to Goma. Yeah, oh, he, he's rough. He can be, he can be rough. Yeah, if, if you get by those rocks. Yeah. Um, um, Mojera, not anything special. I love the telepots. Teleports are a good mechanic. Yeah, very good mechanic. I really like being able to teleport everywhere. Um, the game doesn't hold your hand, but it does. The King of Reliance is one of the best companions in Zelda. Yeah. For this reason, because you can ask him at any time, be like, "What do I do? What do I do?" And <laughs> talk to the fish man. At, talk to the fish at the bottom of the sea. Yeah. What does that mean? <laughs> <laughs> Got this bait. Throw it out here. Not what happened. <laughs> Got a fine fish man, <laughs> Bobby Scar. You you out there listening? <laughs> I like meowing. That's funny. Meowing during during uh, uh following the, the the girl, on on windfall. What's her name? Some... Maggie. Or no, Mag Maggie's the. Like I said, I Mila. had I had a very not fun time playing the SD version, but boy, did I very much enjoy Wind Waker, and I reevaluated everything I thought about Wind Waker because of the HD version of playing it for the first time. It is a nine out of ten. I'm a, I'm in agreement. I don't think it's perfect. I, I, I like the Triforce Quest is gets that yeah. point off. I'm but not. it's just a very fun, fun time. The combat's really fun, which we'll get into. Like I had a, such a good time with all of that nostalgia. It, it, Toon Link's so memorable. King of the Relic is so memorable. So th this is where MC pulls out another ten. <laughs> I, I I am doing it. The sounds, the sight, like being even like within earshot of the Wind Waker gets me excited. And I feel like it's the same for many people out there who, who, who played the game as a kid. I don't know. It 
it's a different type of Zelda. It, it, it's that, that Ocarina of Time like adventure spirit within you that the game really invokes. Just because Link is so so engaging, how he looks at objects like, oh, what the chest? <laughs> you know, what are you what are you doing here? It's it's a, it's a ten for me. I don't know why I wouldn't do a ten. I love playing the game, and if you can if you manage through the first, th this game has a uh, a, a twenty minute. Uh, opening into the Forsaken Fortress, which ha that has a stealth section, which kind of... No. Th that's a little bit of barrier entry, but, I mean... You're going to hit a 10 for nostalgia. It, Boy, your goggles are so tight. My goggles are very tight. <laughs> your goggles are so tight. The nostalgia factor is huge for me. I, I think, like, the only nostalgia factor for me... Like, it it's a very fun game. I very much enjoyed it, but the music kind of just takes precedence over everything. Like... Like, I just, I don't like any of the other characters a ton. Not Medley? No. What about the, the old sage, Laruto and Fado? They, they, I mean, they don't have a lot of stuff, but I mean, like... No. Uh, I mean, I like, I, I, I do like all the bird people. Like, they're cool. The Rita. Like, yeah, because yeah, they're just like, hey, guess what? We're Zora. We're trapped to the sea. Hey, wait, the sea's everywhere? We're birds. <laughs> 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 like, it, it, <laughs> it's, Not a lot of land... Forced to fly. What about Prince Kamali? Oh, he sucks so hard. He does at first, but that's called character like growth. My orb. Uh, it's called character growth, my guy. Learn something. Write down a ten for me. <laughs> All right, dude. I don't want to do it. <laughs> I know you're gonna cancel it. Are you making me a ten? No, I'm canceling those six. I I don't know. I'm not. So you're trying to make me a six? Yeah. I'll, I'll make... Oh, 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 wow. You did I'm use powering it. it. Okay. I, I feel very strong that I do not want MC's thing to say that my nostalgia for Wind Waker is a <laughs> six. <laughs> All right. Wait, no, no. I, I, I don't... You, it stays six. Oh, yeah, because we... We, yeah, we, yeah, we, yeah. we... we doubled. We canceled each other. Yeah. yeah. So... Heart. 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 Okay. Well, there's like three hearts played this game. I'm out of hearts. I got one left. So he can override me once more. <laughs> Link's Awakening is going to be a, a, a open field. Fighting. Fighting. They did a really good job with the fighting. The, 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 the parries are okay. I, I, I love the sounds when you attack. They did a very good pop, pop, job. Pop, 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 yeah. pop. And there's good good use of different items in battles. Um, bows and, and hookshot especially. Um, grappling hook has uses for gaining... Uh, Goodies? Yeah. Necklace. Um, boss fights are all fun. I, I didn't really find any boss fights that I just hated. The boss fights weren't hard. No. None of them were hard except for Puppaganon. And... Puppaganon was extremely hard. And then I did have a trouble the first time getting Zelda to line up during the final battle. Because she yeah. just never would just shoot. And she just hit me. Um... Enemy variety. There's a lot of enemies. There's a lot game. of there's a lot of enemies. There's a lot of big butted enemies. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you, you got your mob ones. You got your dark nuts. You got p hats and babas. You got um, you know what enemy sucks keys? the most? Ice keys. Uh, rats. <laughs> rats. The rats are in this game. You got the pose. Ooh, St the stealth oh, are are awesome. Gibdo. There's redeads. Yeah. No, not yeah. No, no, no gibdo. Re yeah, the redeads. Yeah. Those are the scariest. Um, there's, there's lots of enemies. Yeah, no, they're all really uh... sea hats. <laughs> no, sea hats are. <laughs> I hate sea hats. Um, the, the, there, there's there's Georg, the there's, shark. Yeah, <laughs> he comes at you. I've always been happy with Wind Waker's enemies. I don't think that it's like anything to write home about because I don't think the bosses are that hard. No. I, I honestly think the fighting system could be improved because parrying is the only thing, and you get the great quick spin, which is useful against Jaw Hall. Yeah. Yeah, I, I was feeling like an eight at best. I was okay. We're pumping now. Yeah. <laughs> I, items. You got the quick, the the, the swift sail. For yeah, the, made, the, uh, it made the game infinitely better. It really did. Like if, if you had the swift sail from the initial thing, I, I feel like you might have posted your world score, honestly. Yeah. Um, but you know, so 
um, and that's not something you pick up usually. Yeah, no, <laughs> if, right. you, if you don't know what's going on. Yeah, if you don't know about the swift cell at all. Who, who thinking... turns Who turns around at DRC and goes or DRI and goes back to Windfall? Yeah, people who know about the swift cell, not yeah. not Joe Schmo. Um, first item you get in the entire game is a telescope. Telescope. Okay. <laughs> I during my hundred percent run, I found some uses for the telescope. Oh, really? I, I I pulled that baby out at like three or four times, and I was like, you know, that would be helpful right now. <laughs> <laughs> um, they did get rid of one amazing item. Tingle tuner. Oh, tingle tuner. Yes, but we're, so so and replaced it with uh, a dead dead social media service. They did. Um, the the whip is fun. Like the grappling hook. The grappling hook is really cool. The um, I, I love the the leaf. The day leaf is it's an all star item. It, 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 it literally like it has I, both I, mobilities I, and a. Yeah, I wish the uh, glider was as functional as in Breath of the Wild as the Deku leaf was. Yes. I wish you could do so many cool things like that. And this is also the first instance of the boomerang being able to do the multi selection. Yeah. Do, 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 do. Which is really neat. Yeah. That made the boomerang actually have a purpose beyond the bow. Cause Fighting Kali Damos. Yeah, yeah. What a good boss fight. Yeah, no, that's what I'm just saying. It's, 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 all the bosses are easy, but boy. Um, it, it, like, 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 there's some items that are like, like the hookshot is, 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 is it, at this point, it, it, it has been awkward of time happened. Okay, there wasn't actually a lot of uh, hookshot in between. Um, what, did I, what, did I, what did I place wrong? Sure. FSA. So this is. So we had, um, yeah, hook shot used in Ocarina of Time, Majora, A Link to the Past, uh, the switch hook in Ages at this point before Wind Waker. And at this point, I felt like the the hook shot got stale, mm -hmm. while Twilight Princess was the one to actually renovate it with with double claw shots. Uh, the Wind Waker sick. Oh, the actual Wind Waker. Yeah. It it I think it took the Ocarina bit and made it a little bit. Smoother. Yeah. It, it did lose like the ability, like you know. They, I, I, one thing I did like as uh, like an ocarina of time, like you can change the pitches and everything like that. Yeah, that was cool. That was cool. Uh, and then the wind waker is just like by doing that, like you're like, oh crap, I can play a lot more notes and all this crazy stuff. Like, I can add a lot more really cool things to it. Um, it's not really utilized. Yeah, but it's really cool. It's neat. Um. Yeah, there's just a lot of just okay items all around. Um, the hero's charm, the magic armor, <laughs> is in there. The, f the what's the the hero's mask? charm yeah is that the hero's charm yeah yeah the mask yeah what else um you got a house the cabana oh you get the the, the mailbag yeah the, so so like some of the side quests uses the mailbag which is really neat it's all right it's it's, it's average uh, just above average I'd say because I like the grappling hook a lot I, I I say seven just because yeah I, I like the grappling hook and the Deku leaf I feel like hookshot is kind of stale though. yeah the meat. The dungeons. They're all just islands. They're just the every island you go to. Well, I mean, the insides of them are all unique. Yeah. Which is fun. Um, I think if I rated them... I love Forsaken Fortress. They're all pretty much pretty linear. Yeah, they're all just go to the end. Lock and key, next, next, next. Um, Forsaken Fortress is fun. Um, it's never really used as like a proper dungeon. It's, it's best I mean, the first time. Hyrule's fun. Hyrule Castle. Yeah. I mean, that's also not really a dungeon. That's just yeah. like a, a, an enemy gauntlet. It's like, it's, yeah, it's like it's the, the, the most fun, meaty parts of the game are not actual dungeons. I, I enjoy, I think Dragon Rooks Cavern's an excellent dungeon. I like Tower of the Gods. I know a lot of people don't because it is very linear, very deep. But I, I like the aesthetic of it. Um, Earth and Wind Temple are both... I think Earth Temple's good. Wind Temple, I think... I really like Wind Temple, but I know some people have a problem with it. It is the least linear of the, the, the ones. Yeah. Trials suck. Trials suck. I hate the Wind Waker Trials. They're my least favorite Trials of any Zelda game. Yeah, it's obnoxious. It's... Oh man. That's unfortunate. You had to say Trials. Because I forgot about them. I'm sorry. I'm here to be impartial. <laughs> <laughs> All right. They're, they're okay. Yeah. They're okay. Gimmick. So the biggest one on this is, uh, I'd say the gyroscope touchpad. Like the touchpad is like... The, 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 the Wii U gamepad. The, the, the Wii U gamepad. Boy, it did everything right. It, it, 
you get the aiming precision. You, you can turn it off if you don't oh, like okay. the gimmick. Yeah. You have you're able to see your menu, switch hot switch items real fast. Um, when you're playing the Wind Waker, you can see all the music right in front of you, which is so amazing for me. And, and if you want to, you can play it on, on just the gamepad. Yeah. And you can still do the, the, the you can play the whole game on the gamepad as well, which is so cool. Cause I like the gamepad, man. I, it was just they did it wrong. It was before its time. But boy, I I I actually played that in bed, quite a bit. Like when I was just like, well, I'm gonna I want to play, but I want to play on my TV. But I was plugging into the wall. Like there was points I used to work at a um, I was a manager at a store, and I brought my Wii U in on my breaks mm -hmm. to play, like to learn tricks and stuff off the window. I was like, wow, this is really cool. I, I was screen with me off the use the HDMI cord ever. Gamepad's so cool. I really like the gamepad. I so many people hate it. I thought the game was good. Gyroscope's sick. Yeah. Touchpad's cool. Ah. I think it's the best gimmick we've had. I think it's my favorite gimmick. <laughs> yeah. Many... It's the best gimmick we've ever had. Double nine. Let's total them up. Let's see look how it fares. Wow, look at that. Quadruple nine. Wow. This is wow, this is a lot of this is a big scoring one. What's it at? Well, 136, tying the TP score. Wow. And I'm going to use... I, I, I am using this, if you t if you could not tell. And this is to double up on the story and the uh, and the, the, the parallel between the King and Ganondorf. The, the, it, to this day, makes me have emotion. I agree. I'm adding one as well. Oh, wonderful. Yeah. <laughs> we have a tie between the Wind Waker and TP for top. Really? It, it is an exact tie. That's incredible. 156. Wow, that's insane. That's incredible. I wonder if Link's Awakening can beat it, because that's the... Last game. Where is it? Oh, you, you took it out. That's us well, get out of here. I got, a, I got a negate. You, he has one negate, and he also has a 10-point. I do. You see, so, so Campy still has a 10-point, or I'm out. I'm out of power-ups. So ne next one will be definitely a Campy power episode. Link's Awakening. Link's Awakening is such a good game. The, the finale. The finale of the series of the ZZZ. Can't wait. It's been a journey. See you there. Comment. Comment. Comments, comment. Like, subscribe. Comments. Let us know. Comments. Watch the old one. Share it with your friends. Tell me what you like. I can't believe we tied. I can't either. This is incredible. <laughs> this is high drama on YouTube. <laughs>